from the line as well. He's only 6 of 16. The free throw. Arguably the easiest shot in basketball, the free throw is essentially a wide open shot 15 feet from the basket. In the NBA, the average free throw percentage is 73%, while the greatest free throw shooter recorded is Steph Curry at 90%. In this video, I will explain the variables present during a free throw, and I will be calculating the different variables such as the velocity and angle at which I shot the basketball as I approached the hoop. I then measured the height of the basket, which came out to around 10 feet. After the measuring the basket, I then measured the distance from the bottom of the backboard to the free throw line, which was around 15 feet. After shooting the free throw, I measured my release point, which was around 74 inches. Now that we have all our measurements, I converted it into the metric system with all our uh, measurements right here. So the basket 10 feet equals 3.05 meters and the distance to the free throw line 15 feet, which equals 5.8 meters and the launch point, which is where I shot the ball, like the release point of where I shot the ball, 74 inches or 1.88 meters. With this information, we can use this equation right here to figure out the velocity in the y direction. So let's plug in the numbers. So we have theta equals vi squared plus 2ad. So now we know that the final velocity is going to be 0 meters per second. And then we don't, we're just trying to solve for the vi squared. And the acceleration negative 9.8 meters per second squared. And then the distance is going to be the distance from the basket to the release point. So it's going to be 3.05 meters minus 1.88 meters. I'll now do some math to figure out the rest of the equation. And after doing all that math, come out with the velocity in the y direction of 4.79 meters per second. So I'm gonna write that up here, just to take note. Vi y equals 4.79 meters per second. After finding the velocity in the y direction, we can now find the time of the ball at the top of its trajectory using this first equation. So that's what we're gonna plug in now. So Vf equals Vi plus At. We know that the Vf final is zero meters per second. And that equals the VI in the Y direction, which is 4.79 meters per second plus the acceleration of negative 9.8 meters per second squared. And the time is what we're trying to solve for. And then some simple math. After doing the math, I came out with 0.49 seconds as the time to take for the ball to reach the top of this trajectory. So we're gonna Write that down up here. After finding these values up here, we're going to use this equation that I've written already down here to find the velocity of the ball in the x direction. So the distance would be 5.8 meters since we're going in the x direction. This is the x axis equals the vi times the time of 0.49 seconds plus one half. And there's no acceleration in the X, so that's gonna be zero meters per second squared. And then the time, which would be 0.49 seconds squared. Now I'll do some quick math to figure out the result. So after doing the math, I come out to 11.84 meters per second for the velocity in the x direction. So I'm gonna write that up here with the rest of our values. Now that we have the velocities of the y and x direction, we can use the Pythagorean theorem to solve 
for the diagonal velocity. So we know going up, it's 4.79 meters per second in the velocity, and going to the x direction, it's 11.84 meters per second. So now we know, using the Pythagorean theorem, 4.79 meters per second plus 11.84 vi diagonal. So it's this square, that square equals this, the vi with velocity in the diagonal direction. So now I'm going to do some quick math to solve all this. After doing all that math, I came out to 12.77 meters per second for the velocity in the diagonal direction right here. So now I'm going to write that up here with all our values of vi d equals 12.77 meters per second. Now that I have all these values up here, I want to solve for the angle at which I shot the basketball to make the free throw. So knowing this, I'm going to use this equation. Vix equals the Vid times the cosine of theta. So now to solve for this, I'm going to get the velocity in the x direction, which is 11.84 meters per second equals velocity in the diagonal direction of 12.77 meters per second times the cosine of theta. Now I'm going to do some quick math to solve for the theta. And after doing all the math, I found out that 21.56 degrees is theta. So the angle at which I shot the basketball to make it in every time was 12.77 meters per second at 21.56 degrees. I then shot a free throw using a different form, meaning that there are going to be different variables for the release and all the other variables. As you can see, I have missed the shot. Now with our new launch point of 70 inches or 1.77 meters, I will find the velocity of the y direction, the time on the top of the trajectory, the velocity in the x direction, and the velocity in the diagonal direction, all to find the angle theta right here. So with some quick math, I will have solved all of these variables. And I did all the math for all the variables except the velocity in the diagonal direction right here, but we found the velocity in the y direction, which is 5.007 meters per second, which would be right here. And the second one I did would be the time of top of the trajectory, which would be 0 0.51 seconds and the velocity in the x direction, which is 11.37 meters per second. And now I'll be finding the velocity in the diagonal direction using the Pythagorean's theorem. Now to figure out the velocity in the diagonal direction of 12.42 meters per second, we go ahead and find the angle theta. We're going to use the same equation that we used for last time, which is Vix equals Vid cosine theta. The Vix, which is 11.37 meters per second, equals 12.42 meters per second times the cosine of theta. And then some quick math, we'll have it all done. After doing the math, I figured out that the angle would be 24.5 degrees. I'm Mark Rodils. Thank you for watching my physics of a basketball video. Hope you learned something. Like, subscribe, share. We out.